Hey, what's going on, guys? Today we're going to look at... Uh, I'm going to try working on a knife here on camera while we ramble. This is going to be ramble number 27, I think, today. 27. We're getting on up there. Uh, we're going to talk about the YouTube police a little bit. Uh, we're going to look at a wooden handle knife for GR. And uh, I'll probably show you a, a workhorse of a knife for doggone John over there to start his new open tag today. Uh, Reed's gonna be hanging out with me a little bit. To, uh, the guy who made the video it got removed, so uh, my youngest one. But that being said, let's go ahead and get after it here. All right, guys, here we are. Uh, I had started on this before I started making this video and decided, hey, I'm going to try and do it on camera so you guys can ride the struggle bus with me. What we got here is two number eight open nails. Uh, this one's got a carbon steel blade, and I did some some real janky kind of engraving on this thing. And this one was a limited from, from them with this handle, and it's got a, a stainless blade in it super cool handle so we're gonna try and put the carbon steel in this one uh, i think it's gonna take some grinding and stuff like that but uh, we'll get after it we've already got the pin pulled on this one and now we can pull the blade on out and there's there's my carbon steel uh, number eight blade and we're gonna yeet this for a minute get this stuff out of the way so we can get to work on this one uh disclaimer is that uh i don't know where my retaining ring pliers are they would work perfect for this but i'm just gonna put a pair of uh needle nose in there and spread them to open this thing up and pop it off like i said folks the struggle bus Can you hold the knife? We're gonna go off camera here for a second. Just hold the knife. Okay. Reed's here helping me. Pull it, try to pull the knife down. There you go. And there it is. And it's not really damaged. So, so now what we got, we got big pin on this side, little pin on this side, and then we'll be ready to pull the blade out. It's pretty simple stuff. We got a little Dremel tool here we're gonna use. I told you guys I was gonna tell you about the old uh, Vogue Gestapo, the YouTube police that uh, came and censored us the other day. Yeah. There's no rain over here, so yep. Yeah. Uh, yep. I can't remember what ramble it was, guys, but there was one I rode in on a bicycle. Talked about how I could ride a bike better than Joe Biden could. And uh, we got the Bauer Harbor Freight Special. We got a, we're gonna try this drum sander on it first. We're just trying to knock it down just enough where we can get that thing punched through there. Uh, let me grind on it a bit and see what we can do before I, I ain't gonna try and talk over the grinder. Yeah, we're not going to speed it up either. I'm not well enough versed to do that kind of stuff. I believe we'll be able to knock it clean now here, Reed. <coughs> Excuse me. So as I was saying, uh... I made that video. Good night, living. We might have to pause it if I can't get this thing out of there. Uh, Wanna go rage on him? We made that. I made that video, and uh, 
and Reed wanted to make a video where he rode up on his bicycle and said, hey, I'm better than Joe Biden and 865 knives at riding a bicycle. And I told him to carry his pocket knife and uh, he could show his pocket knife. Now that's what we did. We made a video like that. And he rode up and pulled a, pulled a little spider coat ladybug out of his jacket pocket there and said, and this is what I'm carrying today, the spider coat ladybug. And uh, immediately after I posted it, I, I, re I realized that there was like a little yellow uh, caution sign beside of his of the short it was a short it wasn't a video guys and uh like huh that's weird and I asked a couple people I know and they said oh it you know it probably has to do with the music or whatever that happens to me sometimes blah 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 you know and uh it wasn't an hour later they sent me an email telling me how I'd violated YouTube guidelines for child safety and all this malarkey. So, we're kind of at a loss. Oh, we dropped that knife. Sorry that I'm working off camera, guys. I'm trying to knock this pin through. And I'm trying to use a little makeshift vise over here. I've got set up. Trying to punch that pin out. I've got it moving, but it's not moving easily. And uh Try to use that blade. No, we don't want to break the blade, bud. Get that and opened up there a little bit. So they're uh and I don't know how they do that, how how they decide what they're gonna remove and censor and things like that. Uh, what, buddy? You can talk. Uh, but we're going to pause this video for a second. I'm going to go grab a punch so you guys don't have to sit here and listen to me wrestling. All right, we're back. We pulled out the big guns. We got a, went and got a stared automatic punch. We didn't have to hit it with a hammer. We just pushed on it and it eventually started coming. We'll take these. I don't even know what you call them. It's like a mini pair of dikes. Pull the pin out the rest of the way. Just working it back and forth. Old Reed man, he's went in to get his pocket now. He wants to show it again. There's the pin back. There he is, there's the man. Oh, he's got, he's got a good one with him today. Tell us about it, you know anything about that one? The only thing I know about this one is I got a spider ladybug. You got a spider ladybug. You want to stick it in here while I'm working on this? Oh, no. You look at the camera. Yep. We've got a Sabre Ground VG10 blade on it. This is the one that got us uh, silenced by the YouTube Nazi. YouTube Nazis out there. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we've already got this one put in. We're starting to pin back. We're going to flip it over and we're going to drive it in with this pin. That one looks way cleaner than that. This punch, yeah, it's stainless. <laughs> we'll see if we can get the center punch to drive it in. Of course. Nope, we didn't reset. This makes me wonder if we're lined up. It's not working to its fullest extent at the moment for me. Yeah, I'm not sure why. Did you draw that on that knife? No. Oh. 
I did on that other one, that real, yeah. that real janky looking one. <laughs> you like carved it out? Something? Yeah. Well, a wood burner. What else you got, Ray? I got a spider hook. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Got a spider hook. Called a. It's called a what? You know what it's called? No. Wait, was it a uh, river actually? It's a bow river. It's a Spyrico bow river. Hold it way down low. He's got a Spyrico bow river. How'd you get that? I got it for Christmas this year. For Christmas. Santa Claus brand. Um, yeah. There we go. Let me see it. Yeah. So Spyrico yeah, bow river. Like, I'm Santa Claus, everybody. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> it's got it's got this layered G10. It's really slick. It's got this guy. I guess he's the designer, Phil Wilson. Is really his name right here? This is made in the China factory. The scales are removable. We got a great big lanyard too. He's going to get him a lanyard put on there. What's that? You know, the string, beads, oh, that string like that's what you got right here. right here. Yeah. This one has been on that for a long time. Yep, I'll put that on there for you. Like the, this is like my first one. Got knife. a little bitty spider hole. We can see the Spider Co. Spider through it right there. We can see big red thumbs up there. We can see the tired tiger through there. Let's see, there's the, oh, oh, there's the alien outlaw. <laughs> HT, there you are, buddy. There's J.O., Randy. Anyway, guys, that was goofing off there. I don't even know why I was doing that. I read, he thought it was funny, though. Uh, but this, this one's got an 8CR13 MOV blade, which, is, you know, it, it, it works good for what he's going to use it for and the way, he's gonna, the way he uses his. It'll make it easy for us to sharpen. Yeah, he's about ready to learn how to sharpen knives, aren't you? We've got a couple of different kinds of sharpeners, and he, he's about ready to learn for himself. Uh, we're happy with this one. You want to show the sheath off here? Uh, yeah. There's Big E. Here, here's the sheath. It comes with a, a, a nice welted leather sheath. It looks like we've got a loose end right here. Yeah, but look at uh, there. Yeah, we're already, it's already that, busted I do not apart. Know how that happened. We're probably gonna have to find us some good leather worker if we. I don't know if we know any of them. Wink, wink. Out here on the YouTube that can help us out and get us a new sheath made for this, or at least I don't know that you can repair that without taking it apart. But yeah, it's all good. All right, so we'll lay that down there. I can't believe that thing broke like that already. Yeah, I, I had it, and then the next time I saw it or something. Remember well, when I lost that knife? We'll take his ladybug, yeah. He lost it a couple of days after Christmas when we finally found it. Yeah, it we'll lay the ladybug right there with HT. The We're going to slide back this way, though. So here we are. We've got it put together. We've got a carbon blade put in it. Now we just got to get our locking piece put back on right here which this this part's easy you just kind of push it back on there heard that snap didn't you now we oh i didn't have it open all the way open it up rotate the lock and now we we've got carbon steel inside this freaking awesome wood handle for wood handle wednesday where'd you get that i bought both of these they're not very expensive knives i mean like 80 bucks no, more like twelve. Twelve? Yeah, they're cheap. They're not expensive. We got binoculars, flowers, acorns, pine cones, fish and flies. Oh, is that blue we, got a, we got a hatchet or an axe, as Reed likes to say. We got a boot, backpack, carabiner, compass. Looks like a red oak leaf. Yeah, this thing's gonna be awesome. I think I'm gonna ride this one around in my pocket for a while, guys. But. Here you go, GR. That's the wood handle Wednesday knife. Today, we carried the bench made mini grip, which is a true workhorse. Yeah, this is the sheep's foot blade with the spider hole. 
We got uh, OD green and black. It's a S30V blade steel, male part of design. I have no idea. How <coughs> Excuse me, how long this video is going to be? So we're going to cut it off real quick right here. Uh, anyway, uh, hopefully we don't get this one censored. They didn't. But, uh, hopefully we ain't disobeyed any YouTube rules now. Uh, but if you guys don't mind, give me a like, subscribe. Uh, I'm going to throw this out there. Uh, I think we're about seven away from 250. If we can hit 250, we've got a pretty sweet piece where I'm going to give away on Big J in Boston's uh, happy hour knife chat when I'm on there Sunday. Uh, just like they do all the like they do their normal giveaway. Uh, so, we're, last I checked, we're about seven out. So, that being said, guys, we're going we're gonna to end it up. Like, subscribe, get in the comments down at the bottom, tell me what you think. Tell me if you think the, the YouTube Gestapo got me or if I was really wrong. Uh, there were some people that got to see it. Uh, I think there was probably five, six comments at the time on the video. I'd only got to respond to one of them. Um, but I've still got the video on my phone, actually. But uh, it's just not up on the, the tube of views anymore. But that's, uh, just get in the comments, guys. I love talking to you, and uh, we'll talk at you later. See you.